Creating and working with Google Slides, part two. This is just a continuation of the first video. So right now we went over, we already went over the file menu, the edit menu. the slide menu, and the format menu. Let's go over the format menu a little bit more. If you click an image that you inserted, and then you go to format, you can go to image options. I think one thing to remember is instead of using all these menu buttons, you could always just right click anything in Google Slides and all the options come up for you. So you can go to image options here and adjust the transparency of something. You can crop this image right from here, press enter, right click it again, center it on the page, uh, you can reset it. Okay. You can rotate the image. And you can animate the image, which is pretty cool. If you want to fade in, fade out. flying from the top and you want to do it on the click and here's the speed okay and here it is and let's try that in real time go to present And then when I click it, it flies in from the top. Okay, so those are animations. You can add more animations to it. You can add more animations. Delete the animation. Click it and press the X button. So those are animations for images. Okay. You can flip it. Copy it, paste it, add it to a theme. So those are all the formatting you can do for an image. Okay, you can also you can also do the same research tools that you have in Google Docs, your spelling, your research, and your define. Watch the Google Docs uh, tutorial to know what those are about. And lastly, insert. I'll show you a couple of really cool insert options. Inserting a text box is self-explanatory. The image we just went over. Remember, for the image, you can get it from your computer or your Google Drive, Drive, or you can search for it or URL, and you can have different theme, colored themes as well. The best part, in my opinion, of Google Slides is videos. When you go to insert a video, it's so easy to do. You can eat, search for a YouTube video right here. Uh, press search, find a video you like, and there you go. It's that easy. When you press present, the video comes up, and you press play. Hi, I'm John Green. This is Crash Course World History, and today we're going to talk... Okay. And if you have the URL, let's say you don't like this video, highlight it, press delete. You want to insert a new video, go to URL and paste the URL if you have it. It's really the best part of Google presentations of, of uh, Google Slides. Very, very useful, very useful. So insert text box, insert image, insert video. Word art, it's pretty cool also. And if you right click that, you can edit the texts 
or you can edit the stuff up here, fill color, line color, line weight. Okay, so these are all editing options as well. Um, another one I use a lot is inserting shapes and lines. Let's say you want to highlight something on here that you think is very important. Insert a shape. Let's do a uh, circle, but we'll do an oval. Let's say you really want to highlight the word sidebar. Okay, I'm going to move it. Now, once the shape is selected, here are all of your options. This is fill color. So let's say I want it transparent, but I want the line color red. This is fill color, this is line color. This is line weight, I want it thicker. And this is for a dashed line, but I want a solid line. Now look how that looks. That's how you do that. Say it's not even. I'm going to make it a little smaller. And now I'm going to, going to insert a line that points to it to further highlight it. Here's the line. Insert shape, insert line. And by the way, all this can be done right from here as well. Insert a line. I'll do an arrow. I'll put it right here. Same thing, color, weight, okay, line start, line end, and there's all sorts of different things you can do. You can animate any object. I can animate this format. If I uh, right click it, animate. So that's insert. Line, shape, the callouts are another really good thing. Okay, let's insert. Let me see how much time is left on here. Okay, let's insert a shape. We're going to do a callout. We're going to put it right here. Now we're going to grab this, move it there, and inside of the callout, we're going to write bark, bark. And there you go. There's a callout. Okay, so, and you can comment just like on Google Docs. Another really cool option is uh, painting. If you like the way this format looks, you can click the paintbrush right here, and then anything you highlight will take that format to it. And that also works in Google Docs. You can insert links and do pretty much everything else you can do in Google Docs. So that's a beginner's guide to Google Slides. Hope you learned something.